For centuries, Portugal's royals considered Sintra the perfect place to escape from Lisbon. Now tourists do as well. Sintra is a mix of natural and man-made beauty. Fabulous mansions set amid luxurious gardens, under craggy hilltops with grand views. Aristocrats with money and a desire to be close to royalty built their extravagant homes in the same neighborhood. Lord Byron called this bundle of royal fancies and aristocratic dreams a glorious Eden. A handy shuttle bus loops through town from the station, making Sintra's sights easy to reach. Our first stop, the Moorish Castle. The approach is a gentle hike through an enchanted forest. As you emerge from the forest, you see the first sign of the medieval fortifications. Then we come upon the thousand-year-old ruins. These ramparts are a castle lover's dream come true. Built by the Muslim Moors, the castle was taken by Christian Reconquista forces in the 1100s. And what you'll climb on today, while dramatic, was significantly restored in more modern times. Still, with a little imagination, I'm under attack a thousand years ago. 